I'm doing a video, so um, be quiet, please. No weird noises. So yeah, good news. Getting the surgery next week, Tuesday or Wednesday. So gas. Like, finally I know what's going on. I can put a date to when I'm potentially going to be back to normal. Whatever you call normal. It's not really normal for me, is there? Kind of weather though. It's like cloudy but warm. So you go out, you don't get sunburn. Um, not that I do because I'm Italian. I don't know. It's that melancholy feeling. Well, the sky's got that. But yeah, so, me personally, I'm feeling good. Looking forward to getting this done. Yeah, of course, it's surgery. Very minor, but still, like, there's always that thought, okay, it's surgery, you know. But at the same time, you know, I'm looking forward to being better, like, because I think we've had two terrible years, like, so this year, like, is it bad or is it just because the other two years were so bad? You know, I mean, it's difficult to say. A lot of good things have happened too. Uh, a lot of negative things too. A bit of both, like, in my own life. You know, I've been ill so many times. Which has kind of held me back. But this year in general, like, it's been tough for everyone. So I can't just be selfish, like, only I have suffered now. I've seen so many TikToks about how, like, past years were better. Like, there's one, um, of like Squidward from Spongebob where he's like they go back over the years like back to 2017 and he's progressively happier each year going back from this year which is like true for a lot of people my brother is back from work already why go on he's so early from work why anything for a day off work um but yeah, sun's kind of out, it's trying to come out now, like literally in the sky and in my own life. Don't think I can go to Italy, but I'm happy to be here, like, um, it's not ideal this year, but it is what it is, guys. My family love me and they know I'll be back next year in Italy, whenever, another time, Easter or Christmas. Or even before that, but got to get well first. And if you must know, what I'm having is called a peg. If you're in my kind of world of being ill or what, I don't know, not being ill, but like, if you know anyone like me, like that, you know what a peg is, kind of. Or you don't, you probably don't know what a peg is. Um, I'll explain more when I get here, but yeah. Essentially another way to, um, consume food basically because my issue has been I haven't been eating enough because of the intestine issues I have I'm not going to go any further than that like I said I'm honest but yeah this will solve that um, there'll be there's a few other reasons why it will solve it but it will anyway so I want to gain some weight as well as a result of this I'm not going to get overweight, overweight like that's never been me, imagine. 300 pounds of Italian stand, you know. No, it's not going to happen. But yeah, enjoy the next few clips. I want to show you from Monday when I got the good news. Just felt liberated. For one, I go out, enjoy the weather, you know. Um, and I did. Hi, Mass. You back early? Anyway, I can't really have two conversations, guys. I'm doing a video, so um, be quiet, please. No weird noises. <laughs> Family, eh? Can't live with them, can't live without them. What are you going to do? But yeah, guys, I want to um, thank you. I'll leave you with the clips now. 
uh, of Trent Park, which a lot of you will know if you live around here. Trent Park. There's no P in there. Just the way I say it. Um, we do have countryside around here. Like I'm going to allude to in the video. Um, so stay tuned. And I'll leave you with that and I'll see you very soon. When I'm back and fit. So take it easy guys. You know, just chill. Just make the most of every moment. Not spent in A&E. That's what I'm doing. Um, and hopefully there'll be more time for me to make more videos for you guys to see more of this beautiful face but thank you guys all right guys take it easy fam peace I think we were 13, 14 miles outside London, uh, but we are, it don't look like anywhere near London, but we do have countryside, don't worry, any of you who thought we didn't, in your face. Guys, all of a sudden there's going to be like a T-Rex run from behind that bush, right? Uh, see, I, I just take my head like off right now. now. You know what I mean? It looks like one of them scenes out of a movie, guys. Like, a bloody, like, scene from a movie here. Could do, like, some sort of giant battle, yeah? Like the Romans or something, or like, I don't know. Like, you see William Wallace running over that hill, like, fighting for Scotland, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, it is a field full of crickets. And me. It's hot out here.